game 16. Against Zerg, by the name of Brums. I'm going to pronounce the Brums that way, just because I want to. He's over there on the left. And I'm over here. Look at me. Look at me go. There's the good luck. He responds with... A U2. I think I'm just in the, in the U2 league entirely. I always get stuck here. So odd. He's going like that. Let's pull up the old projection tab. That doesn't really tell me anything just yet. Spamity spam. Average. Eh, my average is 13. My current is. What is he doing? He's not doing a thing. Apparently, we're both just typing and waiting. There's not a lot goes on in the first uh, minute or two of the game. There we go. Now I got my scrolling working. So out goes my scout. Oh, there's a bad wall off that isn't working, but here comes my gateway. Now I noticed Day 9 mentioned something where you see what I did there where my probe actually went to the location first and then when he was halfway there I set him to, to build gateway. So if I time that properly I can have the probe on his way to where he's building. This is probably a faster way to get your wall off. Because if you, if you set him to move and then after you set him to move why am I not making any probes? I'm chronoed but nothing's happening. Awesome. But you set him to move, he he's already halfway the distance, right? You've already set him somewhere. So you can actually send him to build a pylon even when you only have like 85 minerals. So you can't say build pylon, go. You're like, wait, 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 wait. And then there's a long gap between that happening. Is that my cyber? Okay, let's see how fast my cyber is going here. Do I have any gas? Hey, I'm mining gas. Look at me go. Alright, I'm still doing stuff. What's he doing? He's got a small army supply. Workers looks good. Guess he's pulling a macro game. He's not pulling any garbage on me, which is nice. There's my zealot. And he's there to just kind of... Well, he's not going to be useful against the 6th pool, because this is too big a gap for a 6th pool. Not to be blocked. The rest of it is pretty well blocked. That's not bad. I get my pylons. Pylon 24. I get supply blocked early on. Too, too often. In fact, I think it was uh, one of the recent games there that happened, and it was just... Oh, it was just bad. Just plain bad. Let's speed this up until something actually happens. We've got a stalker coming out. There's my other gateway. Doesn't look like he's doing much over there. I'm, I'm going to try very hard not to focus on the opponent. In fact, hang on a second. Let's... Let's find out what I know. I went over here, and I saw pool done, and that, and what's actually going on. Evo. What's going on here? Just an Evo chamber. Well, that's interesting. Okay. Let's get back to it. So I'm making some dudes. Warp gate is... When did I start warp gate? Oh well. So warp is finished by around six minutes. That's not bad. So here I come to make my expansion in around six minutes. I don't seem to have 400 minerals around here. I mean, I do try to make some units, I think. Am I making units? Is anything happening? No, it doesn't seem to be making any units. Okay, there's... yeah. There's three. How are we doing? Yeah, okay, we're about even. He has more supply than me. Alright, gateway's done. What's next? Get forge. Sure. I guess I'm I assume I'm getting a forge, hopefully for there's three more. Awesome. Let's have some probes down. Start making a Hmm. Ah, okay. So here we go. Now we're going to see what's going on, because I'm sending over my observer. And let's see what my observer sees. My observer sees... Creep. And a new hatchery. Alright. Oh. And I go up to have another look around. Look at that. That's well done. 
meantime sending out my sending out my dudes here they come they're gonna catch up with the observer in a moment that's good what's going on over here I left my zealots behind for whatever reason maybe I just beamed those in and here they come and alright so we're going in we're gonna stop this expansion He got coming down. Oh, he just spawned some larva. Here's a but. Whoa! There's a bunch of lings. He's about to send down to kill the crap out of me. Am I gonna get this? He's floating a lot of minerals. Why is he at 2,000 minerals? Why have I got four, four, and three? Okay, so I focused down that. I focused down the hatchery, and then I managed to stay alive, probably using guardian shield. I only have one sentry. I think I can probably use a couple more sentries. Yeah, especially since they just killed the crap out of it. Oh, you know what that Evo Chamber's for? No. That's not for... It's not for plus one links, that's for sure. Alright, so... Took that out, even though he outnumbers me for army supply. Why do I... Oh my god, do I seriously only have... <clears throat> so macro, um, macroeconomics being a very important thing that you do back at your base WHILE YOU'RE ATTACKING! Oh, you fool. There, I'm getting another gateway down. Well done, I say. Look at me, I could make, I could make three probes right now, but no, I'm working on other stuff. Don't bother me about things. I'm, I'm doing unit control. Don't bother me right now. All right. Let's see what else is going on. Still got my observer. There goes a warp prism. Really? What's in this? Nothing. Nothing is in this warp prism. Where is it going? And meanwhile, I'm amassing another small little swath of units. Oh, making probes again. I saw one. I saw one happen. What's this? That's an infestation pit and a spire? Can can we get in here before the infestation pit and the spire, please? Please! Macro hatch? Oh, I see. And then he's got this down here as well. So he's got three hatcheries. What am I doing? Not a whole heck of a lot, apparently. Alright, thinking about it. Here it comes. Gotta wait for all of his things to stop. Does that reach anything? Yeah, see, there you go. He's sending out some overlords. Oh, I just barely missed that. Okay, so I go after his economy. That's well done. Good, so I don't waste time on buildings. That's fine. I'm I'm pleased with that. So, really, let me have a quick peek here. Five kills, three kills, five kills, three kills, and four kills. That's pretty good in my books. I accept that heartily. Yeah, that wasn't bad. So meanwhile, while I did that, I come up and I attack his front. Right? Yeah. Yeah, you did. Keep on that front. Yep. So, the lesson there... Attack the front. Go through the back. Attack both. He said some mutas, but it's just it's just too late. He does not. Okay, even though I attacked with a better player, that probably wouldn't have been enough to win. But I did kind of try to harass him a little bit. So this is just sort of lessons learned. He's still got a ridiculous amount of money. Problem is he's trying to make things that are very gas heavy. Meantime. Oh, I finally got up to 31 workers on two bases at 15 minutes. 
What the derp? Oh, did he take me out again? No. Here we go. Come on. Come on up and win the game. They should have plus one. Oh, one, one. That's good. He, uh... He didn't do much with his Evo chamber, did he? One... Oh, no. He got plus one. Well, that's something. Anyway. So that's pretty much that. Attack, harass, do little bits and pieces here and there. I'll have to check and see if this was the first game I played or the second game I played. Yep. There we go. Brums has left the game. Good old Brums. Brums had a good time.